Welcome to Core Updates Hub. Subscribe and press the bell icon for more updates. The headlines blazed with joy. Bangladesh's dream comes true. Newspapers, television, and social media overflowed with excitement, capturing the collective heartbeat of a nation that had waited decades for this moment. The anticipation was palpable, and everywhere you looked, people were talking about the Padma Bridge. The Padma Bridge, a nation united. This was not just an engineering feat, but a symbol of unity, pride, and hope for millions. On June 25, 2022, the air across Bangladesh was electric. From the bustling streets of Dhaka to the quiet corners of rural villages, a sense of anticipation and celebration filled the atmosphere. Millions gathered along the riverbanks, eyes fixed on history in the making. Families, friends, and strangers stood side by side, united by a shared dream finally coming true. The inauguration of the Padma multi-purpose bridge was more than a ceremony, it was the end of a long, difficult journey. Years of challenges, setbacks, and doubts had finally given way to triumph. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina led the nation, her pride unmistakable. Her unwavering determination had guided the project through storms of skepticism and adversity. For Bangladesh, this bridge was a declaration of self-reliance and resilience. Built with the country's own resources, it stood as proof that Bangladesh could achieve the extraordinary on its own terms. The celebration stretched from Dhaka to the smallest villages. In every corner of the country, people danced, sang, and waved flags, their joy echoing across fields and city blocks alike. People watched as the first vehicles crossed the 6.15 kilometer span. Horns blared, cheers erupted, and tears of happiness flowed as the bridge opened to the world. For generations, the Padma River was a barrier, dangerous, slow, and isolating. Crossing meant uncertainty, delays, and sometimes heartbreak, as families were separated by the river's unpredictable currents. Now that barrier was gone, replaced by a modern marvel. The bridge stood as a testament to human ingenuity and the unbreakable spirit of Bangladesh. As night fell, the bridge lit up, its lights sparkling across the water, a symbol of hope broadcast to the world. The glow was visible for miles, a beacon of progress and possibility. For 80 million people in the Southwest, journeys that once took hours now took minutes. The bridge connected families, markets, and dreams, opening up new horizons for everyone. The bridge promised access to healthcare, education, and opportunity. Children could now reach schools more easily, patients could access hospitals faster, and businesses could thrive like never before. It was a fundamental change in daily life. The rhythm of the nation shifted as people embraced new possibilities and a brighter future. The Padma Bridge was more than concrete and steel. It was a promise kept. It honored the hard work of thousands, from engineers to laborers, who poured their hearts into every inch of the structure. The dream, once distant, was now a shining reality. As the sun rose over the Padma, it illuminated a new chapter for Bangladesh. Bangladesh had done the impossible. Against all odds, the nation had built a bridge to its future, inspiring generations to come. The nation, united, looked to a new future. With hope in their hearts and pride in their eyes, the people of Bangladesh stepped boldly forward, ready to embrace the promise of tomorrow. The Padma Bridge made headlines worldwide, its impact reaching far beyond Bangladesh. This was a story of a nation funding its own mega-project after global lenders withdrew. Bangladesh's bold move signaled sovereignty and economic confidence. The bridge became a vital link in the Asian highway, boosting trade across South Asia. China major bridge engineering company's role highlighted shifting global power and South-South cooperation. The project challenged Western dominance in infrastructure, showcasing new models of partnership. The Padma Bridge put Bangladesh on the map, not as an aid recipient, but as a nation building its own future. It was a symbol of a changing world order. Bangladesh is a nation shaped by water, its rivers both blessing and curse. The Padma, a mighty and unpredictable river, divided the country for generations. Its shifting currents and sandy bed made crossing perilous and slow. Ferries were unreliable, especially during monsoon, leaving millions stranded. The river stifled economic growth, cut off access to services, and separated families. For 80 million in the Southwest, the Padma was a daily obstacle. Farmers lost income, patients lost time, and students lost opportunities. The river was a symbol of separation and hardship. 
Building a bridge wasn't just about engineering, it was about uniting a nation. The Padma Bridge was a national imperative. It was the answer to a challenge that had defined Bangladesh for centuries. The dream of bridging the mighty Padma River has echoed through generations, a vision passed down from elders to children. For decades, the river's vastness and unpredictable currents seemed to mock every attempt at connection, making the idea of a bridge feel almost mythical, an impossible feat that belonged more to legend than reality. Early studies in the 1980s and 90s painted a grim picture. Experts declared the project too risky, too costly, and too complex for Bangladesh, a nation still finding its footing. The technical challenges were immense, and the financial burden seemed overwhelming. Yet, hope flickered in the 2000s. International lenders, including the World Bank, stepped forward, promising support and expertise. Suddenly, the impossible seemed within reach, and the nation dared to dream again. But just as momentum built, disaster struck. Allegations of corruption surfaced, casting a shadow over the entire project. The World Bank and other partners withdrew, leaving Bangladesh isolated and the project in limbo. The nation's morale plummeted. In tea stalls and homes, people watched the news in disbelief. The dream, once so close, now seemed further away than ever, perhaps lost for good. Yet in the face of crisis, Bangladesh refused to surrender. The government made a bold, unprecedented decision to build the bridge with its own resources, relying solely on the strength and determination of its people. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina's historic announcement sent shockwaves around the world. Few believed a developing nation could take on such a colossal challenge alone. International analysts and financial experts voiced their doubts. Headlines questioned the wisdom of the move, predicting failure and financial disaster. But for Bangladeshis, this was a turning point. Across the country, people felt a surge of pride and unity. The bridge became more than a structure. It was a symbol of hope, resilience, and national resolve. The impossible dream was reborn, fueled by the collective will of a nation determined to shape its own destiny. Every sunrise over the Padma now brought renewed energy and purpose. The river's challenge, once a source of despair, became a rallying cry. Communities united, chanting slogans and demanding progress. The project was no longer about foreign aid or outside approval. It was about self-determination, about proving to the world and to themselves what Bangladesh could achieve. Engineers, workers, and leaders alike embraced the challenge. With every brick laid and every beam set, Bangladesh was ready to defy the odds and rewrite its own story. Day and night, through storms and setbacks, the work pressed on. The Padma Bridge would rise, no matter the obstacles, no matter the doubts. And when the bridge finally stood completed, it was more than concrete and steel. It was the embodiment of a nation's courage, perseverance, and unbreakable spirit. The nation's destiny was now, truly, in its own hands. With self-financing secured, Bangladesh needed a partner with the expertise to conquer the Padma. Western firms hesitated, daunted by the river's risks. China major bridge engineering company stepped forward, undeterred. Their experience with mega projects made them the ideal choice. The partnership marked a new era, Bangladesh funding, China building. It was a powerful example of South-South cooperation. Chinese engineers brought cutting-edge technology and relentless work ethic. The construction site became a 24-7 hive of activity. Together, Bangladeshi and Chinese teams set out to achieve the impossible. Building the Padma Bridge pushed engineering to its absolute limits, demanding creativity, resilience, and teamwork on an unprecedented scale. This was not just another bridge, it was a dream that many thought impossible, now rising above the mighty Padma River. The riverbed's loose, shifting sand demanded bold innovation. Engineers designed and installed steel tubular piles, some of the world's longest, driven an astonishing 122 meters deep into the earth. These piles formed the backbone of the bridge, anchoring it securely against the river's unpredictable currents. Massive hydraulic hammers, working day and night, and advanced GPS technology ensured every pile was placed with pinpoint accuracy. This precision was vital, as even the slightest error could threaten the entire structure. The bridge was meticulously designed to withstand powerful earthquakes, a testament to world-class engineering and safety standards. 
Every component was tested and reinforced to ensure the bridge's resilience for generations to come. Its two-level steel truss structure carries both a modern highway and a railway line, maximizing its impact on transportation and trade. This dual-purpose design connects communities and opens new economic opportunities. 41 giant steel spans, each fabricated in China and transported over vast distances, were floated on massive barges and carefully lifted into place by cranes. The coordination required for this feat was extraordinary. The logistics and precision involved in every stage were staggering, with thousands of workers, engineers, and specialists working in harmony to keep the project on track. Every step was a battle against nature. Fierce river currents, unpredictable floods, and relentless monsoon rains tested the resolve of everyone involved. The result is a modern marvel, uniting two sides of a nation and transforming the lives of millions. The bridge stands as a symbol of hope, progress, and national pride. The Padma Bridge stands as living proof of human ingenuity, determination, and the power of collective vision. It's a triumph over one of the world's most challenging rivers, a victory against the odds, and a beacon for future generations. Bangladesh had built the impossible, and in doing so, inspired the world. The Padma Bridge transformed daily life for 80 million people. Travel times from the southwest to Dhaka shrank from 12 hours to just three or four. Farmers now reach markets quickly, boosting profits and reducing waste. New businesses and jobs are flourishing in the region. Access to healthcare and education has vastly improved. Ambulances and students cross with ease. Families are reunited, communities reconnected. The bridge broke down psychological and physical barriers. For generations, the Padma was a source of hardship. Now, it's a symbol of hope and opportunity. The bridge is a pathway to a better life. The Padma Bridge is more than infrastructure. It's a symbol of national pride and ambition. Amra Parbo, we can do it, became the project's rallying cry. The bridge changed how Bangladesh sees itself and how the world sees Bangladesh. No longer just a recipient of aid, Bangladesh is now a rising economic power. The partnership with China signaled a new geopolitical direction. The bridge is a showcase for the Belt and Road Initiative and regional connectivity. Bangladesh is now a key player in South Asia, linking economies and shaping the region's future. The Padma Bridge is a statement. Bangladesh is building its own destiny. The Padma Bridge is more than a crossing. It's a connector of people, opportunities, and dreams. It closes gaps in transport, but its true legacy is deeper. For students, farmers, and patients, it's a lifeline to a better future. The bridge has rewired opportunity in Bangladesh, making geography less of a barrier. It's inspired new ambitions and projects, fueling national momentum. The bridge is a foundation for future growth and unity. It's a symbol of progress, pride, and hope. Infrastructure here is about people, not just steel and concrete. The Padma Bridge is a testament to determination, a bridge of dreams for 170 million people. It carries Bangladesh into a brighter tomorrow.